Okay, in this video we're going to be discussing the basic layout of the various phones for the IP office system. I have three different phones here. Uh, this first one is the 9608, which is the IP version uh, with a button module sidecar. The button module sidecar is optional, but we're just showing it here for uh, training purposes. We also have a 1408 and a 9504. So the major differences between any of these phones is the amount of programmable buttons and the layout of the buttons. Otherwise the functionality is the same. All three phones have a message button, a directional pad, a display, they have programmable buttons, you know, your volume controls, your mutes, your contacts, all these, you know, the menu, the call history, those buttons exist pretty much the same between all three phones. Their location varies. The 1408, which we're only going to focus on momentarily, has eight programmable buttons that have paper labels. So the buttons have to be written in as to their functionality. The other difference between the 1400 series and the 9500 series is the fact that the hold, conference, transfer, and drop buttons are hard buttons that are to the right of the number pad. On the 9500 series phones, whether it's the 9504 or the 959608, those will appear here on the display when, they're, when you're on an active call. So this phone, as you can see, similar to the 9608 has a display, programmable buttons, volume control, mute, number pad, everything's pretty much the same. The only difference is the size of the screen. So this one has three screens of four buttons. So we can only program 12 buttons on that phone. The 1408 has eight hard-coded buttons. We cannot add any more than that. The 9608 has three screens of eight buttons. So we can add up to 24 buttons on the phone, and then the optional sidecar lets us add 24 more buttons, or we can actually add additional sidecars as needed. But otherwise, the functionality between all three of these phones is identical. So you have your programmable buttons, your display, your soft buttons, so this will get you into features or your hold, transfer, park once you're on an active call. Your navigation, which lets you go through the screen or any sub-menus that you're in. Your home phone button, this actually takes you back to the home screen or exits any menus that you're in. Your message button, which accesses the voicemail. Then down here you have your directory, your menu, and your call history. So you can go through and you can see if there's any history of calls. We can go through and look at the contacts in the system. And we can hit the phone button to exit out. Your headset button, your speaker button, your number pad, then your volume control and your mute. These are going to be the same buttons on every phone. Their location may change.